Let's begin by opening the Procreate app. Hit on the plus sign. We'll create a ca uh, custom canvas of 2500 pixel by 2500 pixel. We should get 81 layers as depending on which iPad you have. I have 256 GB iPad second generation so I am getting 81 layers. Color profile is RGB. Hit create. I'll be sharing the brush with you and the color palette. So the color palette uh, is already selected and also the layer we have, uh, I am on the first layer which is the basic layer which when we open the procreate happens. Go to canvas, turn on drawing guide, edit drawing guide, go to, there are a lot of options over here, we will choose 2D grid and increase the grid size to maximum. So you should get or, uh, basically one horizontal line and one vertical line so fill the color and make sure snapping is turned on and just drag from one corner it will snap towards the center and then choose select save and load selection selection one now deselect it go to uh, move with it to the second quadrant again select the layer save and load selection 2 you will do this for the remaining quadrants as well deselect it move it to the third quadrant select it save and load selection 3 And similarly for selection quadrant 4, uh, same method, select, and save and load, selection 4. So now we don't need this layer anymore. So we can just uh, delete it. Or you can also clear the layer. After that go to wrench, turn off the drawing guide, we don't need it anymore. And choose a uh, dark color. and fill it uh, as the background you can also rename the layer to background then go to layer 2 and choose blue color and create branches on the layer I like to fill the color manually so I will not go for the solid fill but feel free to drag the color between uh, the closed surface to fill it with a solid fill but I'll be just manually filling the color over here and choose a different color and just create petals around it then yellow creating few yellow uh, around the blue center part of it just to make it a little bit more uh, interesting Once the main uh, center attraction of a piece is done, just duplicate the layer and randomly place it on the on the surface of our pattern. So just to fill it, we'll doing doing it a couple of more times. 
or will ensure to duplicate the copy from the main uh, the first petal that we created first flower that we created please ensure that you create a copy always from that So here we are doing nothing but just randomly filling the surface with our floral pattern. Once done, choose another color such as green and just create leaves from the branches that we have uh, created so far on the floral pattern. After that we are going to fill the leaf. So this also I will be doing it manually just to make it more interesting. The piece looks much more interesting when we do it manually. choose a different color and just create circular blobs on the surface we'll create it just to fill our surface uh, in such a way that there is not much space left
taking yellow color and just filling it in the middle of those blobs that we created. Now please go ahead and just take white color and increase the size of the brush and just create uh, small dots on the surface. Wherever you see empty space, please do this so that it doesn't look uh, empty uh, when we create the final pattern. Now once done just swipe with three fingers and copy all and then again go to the topmost layer and then paste it. This way we will create the entire pattern in one layer. Now make sure that you go to save and load select first and then go to save and load and just horizontal flip and vertical flip and do this with all the layers then to selection th 3 and then selection 4 when we're done with section 4, you will see a slight empty space in between. So what I'll do here is I'll just move one of the elements to fill the piece. this looks so much better but there is an empty space in between so what I'll do is I'll create few purple blobs again I'll create one more blob and the rest all looks good Now this is our final pattern and now what I'll do is I'll three finger swipe copy all and then paste it to uh, create all in one layer and I'll turn on the drawing board edit drawing board make sure the maximum grid size is selected and then duplicate just to keep the original one safe make sure snapping is turned on and just drag it to the one quadrant it should snap perfectly duplicate it and just make sure the yellow line is uh, is showing when you snap it to make sure it's perfect merge down and just duplicate it and bring it to the bottom turn off the drawing guide you will see it's a perfect pattern that we have created.